understanding, not seeing eye to eye. Hello, everyone. Today, we're diving into an interesting English phrase, not seeing eye to eye. This expression is commonly used in both casual and formal English conversations. Understanding its meaning and usage can greatly enhance your communication skills. So, let's explore what it means to not see eye to eye with someone. The phrase, not seeing eye to eye, means disagreeing with someone. It's used when two or more people have different opinions, perspectives, or beliefs about a particular topic, and they can't come to an agreement. The imagery of not looking into each other's eyes symbolizes this lack of agreement or understanding. The expression, not seeing eye to eye, actually has biblical origins, first appearing in the book of Isaiah. However, over time, its use has evolved and is now a common phrase in everyday English to denote disagreement or differing views without any religious connotations. You can use not seeing eye to eye in both formal and informal contexts. Here are a few examples to illustrate its use. In a professional setting, the project manager and the developer are not seeing eye to eye on the timeline for the new software release. In personal relationships, my best friend and I don't see eye to eye on politics, but we respect each other's opinions. In negotiations, the two parties did not see eye to eye during the meeting, leading to further discussions. Several other expressions convey a similar meaning to not seeing eye to eye. These include at odds with, on different wavelengths, having a difference of opinion. Understanding these similar phrases can help you vary your language and express disagreement in different ways. Today, we've uncovered the meaning behind the phrase, not seeing eye to eye. We've seen how it's used to express disagreement or different viewpoints in various contexts. Remember, it's completely natural not to see eye to eye with everyone on everything. What's important is how we manage these disagreements and strive for understanding and respect. I hope you found this video helpful. Happy learning, and see you in the next one.